Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, I'm Chris. And I'm Ola. And we're here today at La Tourette Park. We're at the Nature Center. And we plan on starting at least with, um, I don't know how you spell it. I say it, Hired Doll. Hired Doll. Hill? Yes. There's some ruins there, so we're gonna check it out. Oh, apparently, according to legend, there's a ghost there, so maybe we'll see it. All right, so stick around and come on, let's enjoy the adventure. <laughs> Freezing. Yeah, it is. All right, guys, so we just uh, turned off of the N slash blue trail onto the white trail. This is taking us up towards Hyredale, Hyredal Hill. No, to ruins. Yeah, that's what I said. That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, uh, we're pretty much just seeing what you see behind us is pretty much what you see. We're just on trails walking. Um, hopefully, we'll have some cool history and uh, Runes to show you in a few minutes. It's only really the foundation, but well, still interesting. We'll see you, see you at the foundation. Okay, so this is the next thing we came to. This sign and waiting for instructions. This one. This way? Towards Bucks Hollow. Going towards Bucks Hollow. Literally like five seconds, not even exaggerating, like five seconds after the last video, I, I stopped it. We walked a couple of feet and the one tree had both signals on it. And right behind that tree, the trail split. So we took the white, um, as you can see on the tree here, and we're looking for the runes. It's supposed to be around here somewhere. She said we're at the bottom of it, according to the map. I'm not sure. And we do see what looks like maybe some tracks here. I mean, it is tracks. I can't tell if it's people's or this partially. It just looks like animals. It doesn't look like footprints. So I'm not sure if it's worth trekking up here to see if this is where the runes are or to continue on a little bit. So we'll let you know. There's a mound up there. I don't know if that's anything or not. So let's just try to go up here. We weren't sure. I said, screw it. Let's just try. So the path is down there behind Ola. I think you can really see it, but where those kind of logs are horizontal behind her, that's the path. We came up a little bit. She's about halfway up. And I did see the trail earlier over here. And that's from the side, you probably could come. So we went up the hard way. It's slippery. Oh, dang, I didn't even see something over here. I have to show. Slippery. Yes. Oh, I see footprints here. It's hard to tell what's game trail. Whoa. Oh. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of thorns here, too. Oh, it's like a well. Yeah. It's a cistern. That's where they got water from. History here. Um, I'm gonna call him Mr. Hairdall. Um, he bought the land here and he built the house here in the early 1800s. I'm not sure if he built it or if it's already here, but it's from the 1800s. And his plan was to have like a wine vineyard here, but the soil here wasn't good for growing grapes, so his plans were foiled, so he kind of abandoned it. And the nature kind of took over after since, so. Yes, it's I don't. Sad know if... history, but. Yeah, it's unfortunate. But um, I don't know if they can tell from in the video, probably not because of all the snow. It's very rocky here, and that's what yeah, they said the right. challenge was, is that because of the rocky soil, it wasn't good for uh, making vineyards. And so he actually just abandoned this place. And I think they said, what, it's been like 241 years or mm -hmm. something more? Yeah, something like that. That's been abandoned and just being taken over. So that's what you're seeing right now. This is what's left. I wonder if there's any of uh, the wild orchard trees, I guess, that were planted here. People were saying like uh, wild persimmons, so I'm not sure what a persimmon tree looks like. Me, I wouldn't even know what to look for, but I don't even, and I right don't now- I think we'd find it. No, everything just looks the same right now. <laughs> Found some more steps that we didn't see before. I don't know if this is the front door, the side door, the back door, or vice versa. I'm not sure what the other steps are, but there are more steps here. 
I was trying to find a geocache that they said is here. I'm not sure exactly where it would be. It's just like a hole underneath there. I don't know if there was a basement or not. It's pretty not nuts. I mean, it's it's hard to see a lot here, obviously, because there's snow, but you can kind of imagine it, you know? Now I'm standing on top of those steps. And... Beautiful. I just actually decided to come here. Uh, for your reference, if you're looking, instead of blazing your own trail like we did, just uh, look for that. <laughs> and there's a trail down here that you can walk. Simple, straightforward. Let me see if I... There we go. There's a trail there. <laughs> note for next time all right the base of this tree is pretty awesome if you're a little kick you can totally fit inside here let's see what the inside looks like so it's pretty hollow all the way up Pretty cool. All right, let's keep going. We're still on the white trail and it's quite difficult to walk with the snow and ice. So we're trying to be very careful. Don't wanna fall. We just took a cross through. So now we're gonna go towards Hairdall Hill. That's what Chris kept talking about earlier. It's the highest point on Staten Island, I think they said. I thought that's where we were. No, we went to Herodal Ruins. Alright. Well, it's a little bit wet here, so it's not frozen solid. Let's some place to see how we can where are you left? Go on to the do this. Yes, let's do that. <laughs> that sounds smart, Chris. was moving. All right, you can go blue here, this way, but we're gonna continue on the red this way. Red and yellow. Same thing on the trail. Icy in some parts, snowing some. Still didn't find the persimmon trees. But it's not a bad walk. See a sign. Oh, Chris sees a sign. Is that a sign? <laughs> so, what's your sign say? We can go to the golf course or to Nature Center. Where do you want to go? Well, I don't do go golf right now. Why not? We could do snowball golf. That'd be fun. All right, now we're inventing something. Now we're talking. <laughs> All right, let's head back towards the nature center. So the same squirrel is still here that we saw earlier, making that weird sound. I don't know. I can't make it. I can't make the noise. I don't know how to do it. <laughs> All right, we're gonna be heading back towards the nature center. And see what's around there. Oh, so this is where we came out, it went to, oh, okay. Yeah, there's a lot of trail systems Starting in here. Starting to gain my bearing now. <laughs> so I thought the end was like, because we saw an east, so I thought it was like maybe the, the directions, like northeast that, Maybe it is. I don't even know. But I'm thinking it ends maybe Nature Center. Yes, and is Nature Center. You know it's Nature Center? Yes. Why don't you tell me that when I was yelling out directions? All right, guys. We're going to end the video here on this one. Apparently, if you want to go one way and take either one, any one of the trails, just one way, it's a it could be really long. Yeah, they said the blue trail is, what, like 12.3 miles? Yeah. The white was... 7.6. The, the yellow is 4. And well, the, the yellow, I thought it said 8. Oh, the red's 4. Sorry. And the yellow is... Dang. 
Yeah, so there's a lot of like one way trails that you can make extremely long. We which did a is loop, cool. so we didn't do anywhere near any no. of those. <laughs> <laughs> but <laughs> it's cold. Yeah. Um, there's some there's history here, so if you can see some of that, it's probably easier to see in the warm weather. Is don't forget to like, yeah. subscribe. Hit the oh, bell don't forget to like, subscribe. <laughs> Just kidding. Go ahead. No, yeah. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you know when we post new videos. Leave a comment down below if there's a place that you think that we should check out and share it. Share it and share it. Anybody you know that you think might be interested, not interested, we don't care. Anybody, just have somebody watch it. Put it <laughs> on their TV when they're not looking. Whatever you got, we'll take it. <laughs> and uh, as always, we'll see you in the next one. We'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye.